watching CBS. Through. And open the door. Perhaps he'll keep going and forget to come back. Here it is, Squeaky. Your cheese of the month club. Whoa! Hey, hey, handle with careful, Bart. These are very special cheeses from around the world. And every single wedge is totally inedible. <laughs> hey, you! Silly rodent. Why would anyone buy cheese they couldn't eat? Use your bean, widescreen. This ain't eating cheese. It's heaving cheese. Oh, no, no, no. I've been cheesed. <laughs> yep, I'd say this is starting out to be a great day. Fan mail, Ranger Sully. Whoa! Ow! Oh. Ow! Who put that there? I'll help you, Fallbot. <laughs> Nothing like getting my fan letters airmail. Thanks, Fallbot. Fan mail, huh? Oh, yeah. Just a lot of boys and girls, moms and dads who want my autograph. My picture. You know how it goes, kitty. <laughs> yeah, some days it's tough being me. Oh, are those the same days it's tough to spell your name? What? This fan mail's addressed to Ranger K-I-T-T-Y. Ranger Kitty. Ranger Kitty. Ranger Kitty. And, oh, what do you know? Ranger Kitty? Nope. Ranger Bert. Yeah, all the chicks dig him. <laughs> Over at Scientific Studies Magazine. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Hey, that one's for me. Hey, who's it from, big guy? Mr. and Mrs. Barkster. Really? And who, put chance might they be? <laughs> when I was a kid at the Pine Lake Orphanage, they were kind of like a mom and dad to me before it got adopted. What's it say, Burble? They're having a be ready for any emergency jamboree. Says the kids at the orphanage are sponsoring it, and they want me to be the special guest of honor. Hey, who wants to come see where I grew up? Oh, oh that sounds great. Verbal. Count me awesome. in. This is going to be great. We'll give those kids at Pine Lake a Danger Ranger day they'll always remember. Welcome, welcome, everybody, to the first annual Pine Lake Emergency Jamboree. We want to thank all our local emergency workers for coming to help us get our homes, families, and schools ready for any emergency, big or small. It's going to be a day of fun, games, and safety surprises. Luke, do you and the kids have the house ready? Sure do, Mr. Barkster. Don't we, guys? Yay! <laughs> oh, can't wait for Danger Ranger Burble. Everything is ready, Luke. We're ready. This is great. Oh, children, look. Here comes Ranger Burble now. <gasps> cool. Hovercraft. Come on, Luke. Burble, wait to go. Hey there, little guys. Hey. <laughs> wow. oh, 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 don't squeeze too tight. Don't squeeze too tight. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Baxter. Oh, oh, my, how you grown, Burble. Oh, Martha, don't embarrass the boy. <laughs> but you're right. Everybody, I'd like you to meet my friends, Ranger Sully, Ranger Kitty, and Ranger Squeaky. Pleased to meet you. I'm the big bear rug's roommate, you know. Excuse me, Ranger Burble. Hi, I'm Luke. Um, Amy has something for you. It's kind of from all of us. Mrs. Boxdoor says peanut butter cookies was always your favorite, Ranger Bubble. Well, how do you think I got to be this big, Amy? <laughs> <laughs> Same old burble. <laughs> all right, listen up, everybody. Sully, Kitty, and yours truly will get the Danger Ranger emergency game set up, all right? Games? 
All right. What kind of games? Games that'll make you Danger Ranger ready for any emergency. Ranger Verbal, could you show us some of your skateboard moves? Yeah, yeah. Ranger, your Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> okay, okay. Ranger Burble's totally cool, huh? Yeah, I guess. Anyone want to try my Burble board? Luke's the best boarder here. I'll bet he can do that trick. Well, is that right? Well, why don't you show me one of your favorite tricks? No, I'm going to do one of yours. All right! Took me months to learn that move, Luke, but you came pretty close on your first try. Cool. Luke's better at windsurfing, Ranger Burble. Uh, one to show you? Yeah. I can do all sorts of stuff on the water. You want to go down to the lake with us? Come on, kids. The Danger Rangers are ready. How about I check you out after, Luke? I'll be hanging here for a while. Well, yeah, whatever. It's all good. Oh, oh really? 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 Come on, Denny. Where? Down to the lake so I can practice. Are you sure? I mean, we didn't tell Mr. Barkster. And what about the Danger Rangers games? Well, quit worrying, will ya? We're only gonna miss the first part. I'm gonna polish up my best moves. I'll show Ranger Burble and the other kids I'm just like him. Danger Ranger Luke! You'll be hearing that name one day real soon, Denny. Oh, you're gonna become one of the Danger Rangers? <laughs> Wait up, Luke! <laughs> what do you think of your old bedroom, Burble? You turned it into the game room, Mrs. Barkster? Every child who comes to stay with us knows you used to live here. <laughs> and they all want Ranger Burble's old room. <laughs> That's right. So the only fair thing to do was to let everyone have it by turning it into the game room. <laughs> That's a great idea. But has anyone ever found my old secret hiding place? Secret? Where? Oh, where? Where is it? Where? It was kind of my own personal emergency kit. More the start of one, anyway. That's our verbal. Yep, thinking like a danger ranger even when he was a kid. Did you ever have to use this stuff for, you know, like a real emergency? I do remember one stormy night. I probably wasn't much older than you, Andy. There was lots of wind and rain, and suddenly, all the power went out. I could hear the other kids calling out from their bedrooms. They were scared and didn't know what to do. Did you save everyone, Ranger Bubble? Well, because I was prepared, I was able to help the younger kids. But then, just as we were getting ready to go downstairs, where Mr. and Mrs. Buckster had lanterns and a fire going in the fireplace, suddenly, we had a big emergency. What happened after the tree crashed onto the house, Ranger Burble? Were you scared? Yeah. Oh, he was the big hero that night. He kept everyone calm. Oh, looks like I better get this covered with a tarp before the hall floods. But everyone else should stay out of this end of the house. So we get an emergency crew in here to remove that tree, and we gotta make sure our power's okay. Burble, do you remember our emergency escape route from this floor? Well, I sure do, Mr. Barkster. Follow me! Burble took charge, making sure everyone got down to the storm cellar safely. And we all talked about what was happening, how we were a little bit scared, but how the radio was saying the storm was passing through and everything would be better in no time. Burble was our hero that night because he was ready for the emergency and knew what to do. What's an emergency, Wendell Burble? <laughs> well, it's an emergency, Amy. And 
Zavo, can you show Amy what kinds of emergencies kids might have to be ready for? Oh, yes, I can. And yes, I will, Amy. An emergency can be when a fire breaks out. An emergency can be if a big storm causes flooding. An emergency can be an earthquake or a tornado or any problem that causes you to follow a safety plan or use your emergency kit, which I might add everyone should have in a safe place at home, at school, and in your car. Sabo's right. Always have an emergency kit handy with at least a flashlight that works, a radio with batteries, an emergency blanket, a first aid kit, food and water, plus some extra batteries. Oh, and be sure to have a grown-up check about every six months to make sure the food and batteries are still good. Splendid, Ranger Sully. That is indeed one danger-proof emergency plan. How was that? Uh, please, a trained seal could have done that. I am a trained seal. Uh, I rest my case. It's important to have a kit like that, because you never know when an emergency will happen. Burble had his emergency kit the night the tree hit the house. He knew the escape route for getting out of the danger zone. And he talked about his feelings. Yep, talking to people about what I'm afraid of always makes me feel better. What do you guys want to bet you'll be just as Danger Ranger ready for an emergency once we play? Da -da -da -da! The Danger Ranger Emergency Challenges! Let the games begin! <laughs> How do you keep an accident from happening? How do you stop the things you can't control? A car can lose its brakes. And people make mistakes. And storms and floods and quakes come out of the blue. What do you do? How do you keep a hurricane from blowing? You can't. There's things you can't avoid, but don't be scared. Sometimes you can't prevent an unfortunate event. So what do you do? You be prepared. Be prepared. Be prepared. And be thinking just in case. Be prepared. Yes, you dare to have another plan in place. Be prepared. Because when there's a chance that someone could get hurt, though you're careful and you've checked, there's things you don't expect. Like walking with your friends, you go out hiking. How would you know the rocks above are loose? You got no crystal ball. To see those rocks would fall, but did you bring a phone to call if you need help? Be prepared. Your car is on the road, you flat a tire. Uh-oh. But think of all the trouble you'd be spared. When you learn that because of Dad, you're not sunk. The spare is in the trunk. Say thank you, Dad. For so being prepared. Be prepared. Be prepared. Yes, and all the things you do. Playing sports, know the rules, wear the right equipment, too. In the crosswalk, you're right, but a car could run the light. That is why, without a doubt, what life is all about is be prepared. Be prepared. If you want to be the best, be prepared when you go to take your math and English test. Have you memorized your address and the place where you belong? When you go outside, remember, take your common sense along. And always bear in mind if something ends up going wrong, don't panic, keep your cool and don't be scared instead think ahead be prepared blanket check water check food check first aid kit check, check. meeting place meeting, meeting place, place. The Oneida County Health Department wants to remind you to always be prepared. Got an emergency plan? You should. Take steps to keep your family safe. For a complete emergency checklist, go to ocgov.net. Get a kit, make a plan, and be informed. Always be prepared. Flashlight? Check! Brought to you by the Oneida County Health Department and this station. What's happening, isn't it? Nightmare scenario. If these systems converge over just a hurricane, it'll be a super storm. Two big beasts marching to the same drum! Three million people about to get clobbered. Now we got no way to warn them. You guys have got to go. What about you? I can't leave him. Hang on, we're going to get some help. we got to help those people. See you one come right up on tail. i got to go, i got to go. We're talking about lives at stake. I can't see anything. Well, I know that this happened. What do we ever do, Mother Nature? Listen up with both ears. 
<clears throat> when I give the signal, whoa, <laughs> everybody should pick out things you think belong in your emergency kit. Remember, you might need this kit if a storm or any other emergency leaves you with no electricity. No heat or water. No Luke or Denny. What? what? Luke and Denny aren't here. I'll check outside. They probably got distracted by the fire truck demonstration. Get ready, get set, go! Remember Ranger Burble's story? He had what a flashlight. Like would that be good in an emergency kit? I think well, the bottles would be good. Are ski boots a good idea to have in an emergency kit? Well, what do you think? You never know when it could snow. Well, that's true, but most likely you won't want to go skiing in an emergency. What if your emergency is an avalanche? <laughs> you got me there, Dex. But let's look for things you really need every day and every night. I wouldn't need a blow dryer, because there might not even be electricity in an emergency. The plant isn't right. Oh, I know! Granola bars! I gotta eat every day, even in an emergency. That's right! You should always have some food that'll keep for about six months stored in your emergency kit. Granola bars are perfect. Oh, sure, granola bars to use, but if I get caught in Dex's avalanche, <laughs> I can use it for skis. <laughs> Ride those waves, Luke! Whoa! Now, yeah, wait till Burble and the kids see this move, Dad. Try the air attack. Check this out, Denny. Awesome. Hey, Luke. Maybe we ought to head back. Luke, come on. Let's go back. I'm trying, Dad. It's getting pretty strong. Coordinates and status report, Savo. No one has seen Luke or Denny. I'm registering a red alert water emergency. One half mile offshore. Grid located 25 degrees south by southwest. Savo, give me a thousand zoom scan with pixel enhancement and a spectrum filter overlay. Pronto. Scan lock on moving target. <laughs> it's Luke. Then Denny can't be far off. Well, what are we waiting for, guys? This coat ain't getting any redder. Ranger Purple. We'll talk about that later. Let's get you out of here. You 
went against the house rules coming down here without an adult. That means ground, both of you. And you'll have to apologize to Mrs. Boxster and the other kids who are worried sick. Sorry, sir. Yes, sir. We will. At least you're safe, thanks to the Danger Rangers. I just wanted to practice my moves, so that... So? What? Well, so you'd think, you know, I was the cool kid at Pine Lake, like you were back in the day. Being the big guy comes with big responsibilities, just like when I lived here. Don't let him down again, okay? Okay. So we're kind of alike, you and me, right? Yep. You're definitely their go-to guy, just like I was. And they're going to look to you whenever emergencies come along. You think you'll know what to do? Tell you what, I'll fill you in on the three emergency safety tips the others learned. Then we'll see if you can put them into action. OK, we covered emergency escape routes. What should be inside an emergency kit? And talking about your feelings whenever you feel scared. So, we'll check out how much you remember. Only now, it's nighttime. So, we'll have a fire emergency drill in the dark. Luke, you're gonna help each team. First, you come with Burble's buddies to the game room. Cool. Come on, guys. Kitty's cadets will stay here in the living room. And Sully's superstars can follow me to the rear hall. Okay, Boxsters. All teams are in place. Do your thing. All right, one make-believe nighttime fire emergency coming up. Okay, Luke, the lights are off and you're on. What do you do if there's a fire outside the game room door and you can't escape that way? Luke, this is kind of scary. Well, that's okay, Amy. Emergencies can be scary. Now, what's the first thing we should do? Mm, use our emergency escape routes. Okay, now, when we can't use that door, who remembers one of the escape routes from the game room? Oh, one way out is through the window and down the porch stairs. Perfect. Lead the way, Dex. Good job, Luke. You kept calm and you used the right emergency escape route. Thanks, Ranger Burble. Now I gotta get down to Kitty's cadets and help them. I think the Pine Lake Orphanage is in good hands again. <laughs> yes, that look could be another Ranger Burble in the making. Oh, come see us again soon, Burble. Oh, I just remembered. Luke had something to show me. Over here, Ranger Burble! Yeah, I practice all morning. Well, you got it down a lot faster than I did, Luke. Great job. Thanks. Someday I'm going to be a danger ranger just like you. <laughs> Who says you can't go home again, huh, big guy? Yeah, I guess I'm kind of lucky. I got three families. Everybody here, my mom and dad who adopted me, and the danger rangers. Bei Erkältung? Grippalkomplex von Doppelherz. Hilft zuverlässig bei Schnupfen, Fieber und erkältungsbedingten Schmerzen. Grippalkomplex von Doppelherz. Nur in der Apotheke. What if a disaster strikes without warning? What if life as you know it has completely turned on its head? What if everything familiar becomes anything but? Before a disaster turns your family's world upside down, it's up to you to be ready. Get a kit. Make a plan. Be informed today. Not the TV again. Ralph, I told you we should have got cable. Go check the antenna now. If you don't want what happened to me to happen to you, take severe storm watches and warnings seriously. Keep your eye to the sky. Hello, 
So may I ask, does your new video game work? Our level one challenge is going to show this family talking about what to do in a home emergency situation. And the player gets to choose for them. Hmm. Now I'll need two wrong answers and one right answer for players to select from, Savo. I have a strange about. <clears throat> when planning for an emergency, you should always paint your living room bright red. <laughs> Good. Now we need to program in the right answer. While planning what to do in an emergency, you should map out two alternate escape routes from every room. Correct. That's using the old hard drive. Next, what's better to put into your emergency kit? A banana-eating gorilla or a flashlight? A flashlight would be so much more useful in an emergency. Which should I program in as the right answer, Sabo? In an emergency, is it better for your family to have apple pie or the number of someone outside the emergency zone that you can call? When there's an emergency, your family should have the phone number of someone outside your area who you can call and tell them you're okay. Speaking of emergencies, I believe I'm having one. Oh, no! Holy smoke! You're shorting out, Sabo! I better shut you down. You know I mustn't ever be offline, Major Bert. I must keep watch for emergencies all around the world. I must... Don't worry, Sabo. You'll only be down for a second. I'll switch you over to backup power, and all your auxiliary drives will kick in. Where's the fire? Oh, hi, guys. The fire's been contained, but some of my wires may have been fried. But the wires that shorted out run through headquarters. They need to be repaired in quadrants 9J at 22C. Okie dokie, Artichoke, make way. This looks like a job for a mouse at a house. Squeaky will have Savo back on mainline in no time. Savo's been working so hard, he almost fried his memory board. Wow, that would have created a major emergency here at headquarters. Right, but you know what, guys? We're Danger Ranger ready for any emergency around here. When you're in danger or when big disasters hit. A fire quake, there's a rattlesnake on the trail and you just got bit. Some folks panic, they all go manic and lose control. It's true. The frightened butts. Do you know what the best thing is to do? Stay calm, breathe in, step back. You're trying to control the situation, Jack. Think hard and stay on track. Check it out for what you can see. Keep calm now, look about. How to get to safety, got to figure it out. Danger lurks and you're scared, no doubt. You ask yourself, what do I do? Stay calm. A crisis and you don't know what to do. A friend falls down, there's a choking sound, and his face is turning blue. But you won't start to fall apart or panic, no siree. You got to, to go, go because you know there's just one way to be. Keep calm, be sure you take a moment to assess the situation, Jake. Figure out what's going on and then you can make decisions as to what you should do. There's something stuck, you note. Reach in and take the piece of candy out of his throat. That's why they say, and I quote, when you're facing danger, what do you do? Stay calm. Look, listen, think. Stay calm. Focus, stay in sync. Stay, stay calm. calm. Take the time to think. Stay, stay calm. calm. Good as new, reboot, and let the fun begin. Does that mean you want to try playing my new game? Well, much as I'd like to, but whilst I was inside Savo's memory banks, I took the opportunity to reprogram another game, one which Savo and I love to play together. No, no, what did you do, you little reprogramming rat? Did you know? Yes, again. Oh, this is good. I like this, but no, no, I've been cheesed. But I'm still ahead by two. 
Well, I guess I could always include a cheesy ending uh, to my latest safety video game. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, a vacation cruise to the tropics. You have so much fun, Danger Rangers. Is everything okay? Alicia's just learning to swim. The Bresky brothers are in the heezy with the cheesy. Phew, some vacation this turned out to be. We still must not lose sight of the real reason we are here, Chaval. Blackbeard's hidden treasure. Have you seen Alicia? I can't find her anywhere. Hey, what are you doing? Turn this boat around. 